Hello everyone, uh, happy new year to all of you. Today we will be studying the last topic of amines chapter that is coupling reactions of diazonium salts. So uh, coupling reactions occur with diazonium salt and another aromatic compound like phenol or aniline and azo compounds are formed. Azo compounds means there are two aromatic ring which are joined by conjugated system of N2. Okay, and in this reaction, the N2 or diazo group is retained, right? So, let us take example of reaction of benzene diazonium chloride with your phenol. So, this will be called as coupling reaction. So, we are taking benzene diazonium chloride. So, this is benzene diazonium chloride benzene ring attached to N2 Cl, N2 positive Cl negative and it is reacted with your phenol. So this is phenol, a benzene ring attached to hydroxy group and this is uh, hydrogen at the para position. This is coupled with your uh, N2, okay, in the presence of OH negative. So what will be formed here? your benzene ring N2 is retained here okay and this is hydrogen this is coupled with this para position of phenol is coupled with this so this is what is formed and along with this your Cl negative and water is also so this is the reaction now this is called an azo compound because the both the aromatic rings is attached to the conjugated uh, n2 okay and this is known as what para hydroxy azo benzene so this is para hydroxy azo benzene right and this is what this is colored, this is orange colored dye. So this is orange colored dye. So these uh, azo compounds are colored and they are used as dyes. Now, uh, if you react uh, your benzene diazonium chloride with what? Aniline. And what will happen that here you will get, for example, this is aniline. Then again, uh, this para position will get coupled with this uh, azo group and here you will get what? Para amine, you will get what? Para amino azo benzene and this is yellow colored dye. right so this is yellow colored dye and this reaction occurs in the presence of H plus so these two kind of reaction these are called coupling reaction because here the para position of the aromatic compound get coupled with your diazonium group and your azo compounds are formed which got which have got two aromatic rings attached through N2 and your final compound is colored dye okay uh, so uh, now uh, so you can say that importance of diazonium salt is what when you can't directly substitute your uh, halogens or cyano group or hydroxy group or your nitrogen dioxide in the aromatic ring like benzene then what you do, you react your uh, compound with your diazonium salt and then you can introduce your halogens, cyano or hydroxy or nitrogen dioxide group in the ring which can be, which, which is difficult to introduce in benzene ring otherwise like through nucleophilic substitution or through direct halogenation it is difficult to introduce iodide or fluoride in the ring but through diazonium salts it can be introduce so this is the importance of diazonium salts in the uh, organic chemistry right so this was all about the whole chapter 
I hope you have learned lot of things in Amin's chapter. Uh, thank you so much.